You can take an entire course including topics in this video through our website and get a certificate of completion from RASOF, the online educational radio frequency institute located in Irwan, California. Instructions and coupon for taking this course is provided at the end of this video. I'm going to show uh, some simulations of different types of uh, filters in this part and uh, in order to understand uh, the uh, operation of filter better and the importance of in, uh, RF design. So let's start with the LC filter as you see in this example. Uh, the circuit is third order band pass butter both filter and we can see the response. So we have uh, six components here and L, they're all L and C as you see here. And uh, let's take a look at the response. As you see here, uh, I'm measuring the bandwidth. Uh, so this part, it's uh, uh, minus 3 dB and minus 3 dB from 2 GHz to 4 GHz. It means that it has a 2 GHz bandwidth and the center frequency is uh, 3 GHz. So as we talked before, for example, let's say and there is a signal which is coming from another system and in this signal or let's say channel has a component at uh, let's say 6 GHz. So it means it's going to be here. So uh, as you see, this filter will attenuate this and the attenuation is like minus uh, 20 dB at this frequency, at the frequency of uh, 6 gigahertz. So it means that this fil filter is kind of a, a gate to accept the, the channels and frequencies only within this range. The range starts from 2 gigahertz up to 4 gigahertz. Another example is the RC filter, a third order low pass uh, trebuchet filter. As you see here, we have an active component. So this is RT RC filter with op amps. We need three op amps and a um, couple of uh, RC components here in this structure. As you see the input and output here. This is the input and output for this structure. And uh, this one is used, uh, as you see, it's a low pass filter and uh, it's uh, operating in lower frequencies. For example, we can use this IF in the, the IF part. Uh, we are going to actually uh, explain the uh, importance of IF filters. Uh, we have a course for transmitter and receiver and in this part um, we are going to explain why we use IF filters, what is the purpose of using for example low pass filter and this is one of the filters that's used inside receiver uh, and uh, as you see the corner frequency here is a uh, 758 megahertz. So it means that if we have a, a higher frequencies we will be able to uh, remove them and we will only um, passing the uh, frequencies with uh, lower with the frequencies lower than uh, around 700 megahertz and the last filter is micro stereo filters the fourth order band pass trebuchet filter the center frequency is 10 gigahertz with the pass band of 5 gigahertz as you see the uh, the bandwidth is a 5 gigahertz uh, starting uh, around like 7 ends and goes up to like 12 and uh, we can make this filter uh, using a dielectric and the distributed elements here and uh, uh, actually it's about the microwave in order to um, calculate the lengths of this distributed elements these wires we have to know the uh, theory of microwave engineering we are going to have a microwave uh, course uh, and in this course we will explain about the uh, transmission lines uh, transmission line matching uh, distributed elements and this kind of things so if you're interested uh, you can take the course and uh, understand the theory behind this design hey guys thank you for watching the entire video i'm going to provide you with a coupon for taking our fundamental basic concepts and components ra rf101 so you can uh, get this course from our website if you go to the page you just have to select the buy this course and register here as you see if you're not registered up to now so you need your username email password and also you have to answer a security question and then you can uh, press the uh, register button uh, press the sign up button and uh, you will be able to uh, register in our website then after that all you need to uh, do is going to the course landing page and uh, go to checkout and as you see click to enter your code you can put the the coupon code here and then apply the coupon so then you will have this course for free and you can uh, take this course as you see you won't pay anything for this course Rasoft has one of the most complete online certificate in radio frequency available which covers practical topics needed to be a knowledgeable RF engineer. Since all courses are consulted closely by design engineers and pioneers whom have worked as RF engineers in top RF companies such as Qualcomm, Broadcom, Skyworks, Intel and Apple as well as avionic companies.
It covers the necessary information to land a job or successful in your career. Your first step to take the prerequisite course, RAH RF101, which we have provided the free coupon for it, RFPREREQ101. See you there shortly.